Hello everybody, welcome to you, a new episode of Daniel's Videos and Etc. And today we're going to be talking about my Greatest Hits Monkey albums and my cards. So here I have this Greatest Hits album that was released in, I don't know, the record's sticking out at the bottom, released in 1972 and 1976 possibly. This is a risk, a, um, released by Arista Records, and not to be confused with the film manufacturer Arista, and Arista Premium, as well as Arista.edu, not the same company. Trust me, it's not. Anyway, so this is the Monkey's Greatest Hits. This is the first record of the Monkey's I've ever purchased uh, a couple, about a year ago from today. Um, I acquired all my other ones later on. Um, the Monkey's Theme, Last Train to Clarksville, She, Daydream Believer, Listen to the Band, A Little Bit Me, A Little Bit You, I'm a Believer, I Want to Be Free, Pleasant Valley Sunday, I'm Not Your Stepping Stone, and Shades of Grey. So, pretty simple. It's got all the record whatever's on them. It's got all the record whatever's on them. And, yep, there's the picture. Very good album. This is the first record I purchased, so... Didn't even know they had barcodes in that year. Then, about last summer, which was the summer of 2014, I purchased this record while I was... Yeah, in summer. And this is more greatest hits of the monkeys. This is pretty much that album, part two. And there's them in some weird color, some sort, whatever, drama, oh, I don't know. Anyway, this one I bought from a record store in Virginia Beach. So, yep. This one has Take a Giant Step, Mary Mary, Sometime in the Morning, Cuddly Toy, Randy Skuskit, Wards, Valerie, uh, You Just May Be the One, The Girl I Knew Somewhere, Saturday's Child, Look Out, Here Comes Tomorrow, and For Pete's Sake. So... I got this, I think, for about ten bucks at that at that record store, and both of these records are in a night. Uh, this one's in better condition. This one's in nice condition. I got this one from Discogs. And as for my physical albums, I got the first album from Discogs. I got Monkey's second album from my aunt, and I got the third album from a record store in Washington D.C. So, uh, Discogs, record store from Virginia Beach. Oh, and uh, the uh, album was released in 1982 by, again, Arista Records. About six to ten years later from the first Greatest Hits album, so, yeah. And here are my collectible cards of the Monkees. So we have just, uh, I, I got these from a, uh, a um, trading card place a couple months ago. Um, yeah, so... I don't remember what it was called. Dallas Expo Center, that was it. So I got these uh, cards a couple months ago. And um, so here's just my, uh, uh, Mike's face. He's all astonished. 22, 36, 10, 30, 29, and 38. Yeah, anyway, I got these from the Dallas Expo Center. It's like some card thing, I don't really remember, it was a while ago, so it was something like that, and I bought these, um, I believe I made a video about it, about them a couple, yeah, I did, yeah, I made a video about these cards, and getting them, made a video, it's like maybe 10 minutes long or something, if you haven't watched it, I'll provide a link, anyway, I got these cards from the Dallas Expo Center, and so, yeah, and, uh, if I, I think I mentioned in the video that I was obsessed with Mike, as you can tell, yes, I am. And I also got, this, so those are the black and white mainstream cards. Here are the color versions. So this is Mike on a bicycle. And there's the group. And those are the colored ones. I have this weird misaligned card. Um, all these I got for about two bucks per card, so yeah. So it's misaligned and it's got this pink border on it. And I got one with a black bottom. And that's the monkey mobile without the monkey spray painted on it. Or the monkey's whatever you put on that whatever's so yeah and I got this sealed bubblegum wrapper thing from 1966 for $35 this is um with the constipated Mickey face I remember mentioning that um so yeah and actually my camera recognizes the faces as physical people so that's kinda weird but anyway that is basically it uh, I think that's all my collection of the monkeys. Again, like I said in that last video with the CDs, I said I'm going to announce when I do eventually buy Instant Replay. Might announce it on Twitter. Might. We'll see. I probably will make a video about it. But for now, thank you guys for watching. Like if you liked it. Dislike if you hated it. Subscribe. Whatever. 
Leave a comment. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.